Video two in this mini series is all about how to avoid selling at the room. Here's the thing, when you go to a networking event, it doesn't matter what network it is, how many people go there with the main intention of buying from the room? Virtually none, right? How many people go with the main intention of selling? Pretty much all of them, right? So there's a networking disconnect there, there's a problem there. If you go into a networking event or into a conversation with someone at a networking event with the main intention of selling your service or product, you're probably gonna lose. If you go into that conversation with, how can I find out more about you and how I can help you and then start to develop a relationship, then guess what? That person eventually will just naturally say, well, what about you? Where are you from? What do you do? What's your business based? What kind of customers are you like? And here's the best phrase that I've ever used in networking. I've gone up to people I don't know and I've said, how can I help you? Those simple words have made me more money than any other technique I've ever used in networking. How can I help you? And I meant it, it had to be legitimate, it had to be authentic. And in reciprocation, eventually they're of course going to ask you the same question in return, which is an invitation to talk about your business. And since they've invited you to, then it's absolutely of course legitimate to start talking about what you do and how they can help you. And that's how networking works, helping each other out, not selling at the room. Make sure you avoid that.